what's up guys gina here welcome back to my channel all right guys so i am about to do a quick little workout at home but i just had to stop real quick and show you guys this little fitness book that i've been using for i want to say the past week now and it just helps keep me on track with my diet with my exercise with everything that i have going on fitness wise so this little book here is basically a fitness and food journal so this book was sent to me from a company called POBO. This book, you just have everything at your fingertips. It lets you write down all of the foods that you've eaten for the day, all of the water that you've intaken for the day, your workouts, your, I mean, all kind of just anything that has to do with fitness and living healthy and living right, you can keep it right here in this book. So to me, it's easier than like keeping it in your phone. So you have to like scroll through, scroll through your phone and the, see where you're at to me this is just a lot more convenient so i mean you can just put it like with your workout stuff so what i do is i have my workout stuff right in the corner and this sits in the corner on top of my yoga mat when i do work at home i'm making sure that i'm not doing the same exercises every day i can go back and see what exercise i did yesterday what exercise i did the day before that because you know that to lose weight and to maintain you have to like trick your body so you have to do different exercise you can't do the same exercise every day so with this book this helps me stay on track to make sure that i'm doing those different exercises every single day so in the beginning of the book it gives you another cute quote and there's quotes like this just inspirational quotes all throughout the book you don't have to be great to start but you have to start to be great so, and then it just lets you have a page that you put all your information on. So, in case you do want to bring it to the gym with you or to work, where you can, you know, get started writing stuff down, you can. And what I like, all through the book, it just gives you information about basically how to start a routine of working out and nutrition, nutrition guides, what you should be eating, how much of these items that you should be eating. This is a page about exercise, working out regularly, why it's good for you, how much water you should be drinking. It's just really awesome that it gives you the first, like I would say the first fourth of the book is about just basically educating you on living a healthy lifestyle. This page right here is cool. It, um, it lets you keep track of your body measurements. And of course, you know, it tells you where to measure at. And then it lets you have progress here. So you can write down the day of the week, your measurements. And then as you're doing your weight loss journey, you can just keep track of it. It lets you put a photo here. And then you can just, you know, keep track of all your goals. When you keep track of your goals, that is how you will not mess up. So like I said, I started, let's see, oh, I started on the 25th. And y'all know I'm doing intermittent fasting, so do not get me for the food that I eat. <laughs> so, but on this page, basically, each page, so this is your food for the day, this is your workouts for the day. So, I started on October the 25th, I just marked off what day of the week it was, and it lets you mark your breakfast, your snack, your lunch, your dinner, how much water you drank for the day, which I didn't drink enough. But, and then you just keep track of your calories here. And if you're doing the uh, macros, I'm not really sure what that is. I, I thought that was maybe some Jenny Craig stuff. I'm not really sure. But if you are doing that, you can keep track of that here. You can write little notes. So like me, I had black coffee for breakfast. Of course, y'all not doing intermittent fasting like I've told y'all before. So I'm fasting for many hours in the morning. I don't have a morning snack. But for lunch, I had grilled chicken wings, cabbage, and corn. I wrote down the calories. I had grapes for a snack. And then for dinner, I had pot roast, mixed vegetables, and some jasmine rice. So, and then at the very end, I just write down my calorie intake. And then that day, I went to Orange Theory. So I do Orange Theory and I do home workout. So for me, I just wrote this little note here at the top that I know that this is Orange Theory. I did the treadmill, the roll, and then four exercises for 55 minutes. And then right here, it lets you break down your cardio or your other. So my other is the four exercises, which is weight training. And then it also lets you, did you get sun exposure? This day I didn't, so I circled the surface. Did I sleep for seven to 10 hours? No, I didn't. <laughs> so 
Y'all, I'm bad sometimes. Don't judge me. Right here is the next day. So this is what I had for my mini fast. And I have black coffee, no snack. This is what I had for lunch, no day snack, and for dinner. I had a little bit more water this day. A little bit more calorie intake. And this day I had a home workout. So I just got a home workout at the top for 40 minutes. I ran up and down my stairs. I did sit-ups, donkey kicks, squats and my resistance band and it's just so cool how you can go into detail and you can really keep track of the steps and the amount of work that you're doing. Oh see, I did good this day. I got my seven to ten hours of sleep. I'm not sure how many calories I burned. I really need to get a Fitbit. But this is just what I have been doing each day. I've been writing down what my body is intaking and what I'm burning. This day I only did a 30 minute workout. This day I ate my food, about 1200 calories. I did another home workout for 30 minutes. And see this is for today. So I haven't filled out my workout part yet because I'm about to work out. So as, as soon as I'm done working out, I'm going to fill this part out. But first what I'm going to do is go back to this page and make sure that I'm, I'm always going to do the stairs because that's my main cardio when I work out at home. But I'm not going to repeat these. I'm going to do different exercises after I do my stairs. So that's what I really like about this book, you guys. And I mean, you just get tons and tons and tons of pages to keep track. And like I said, it just gives you progress reports. It gives you awesome um, little motivational quotes, quotes on each page. So I just really like this video. Like I said, if you are on a weight loss journey, make sure you check them out. This is just something and it's small in size. As you can see compared to my hand, it's small. You can carry it around with you. You can throw it in your purse. You can keep it on your nightstand. And you can just make sure you stay on track. And guys, the cool thing about this, I haven't seen anything like this out there like it. I usually shop at like Marshalls, Home Goods, TJ Maxx. I see like little planners, but I've never seen a planner that's dedicated just for working out and your nutrition. And it literally gives you all kind of tips and tricks as well. So make sure you guys check them out. Their name is POBO. I just think this is something that's really handy. This is really gonna make you successful and stay on track. We'll be doing another in intermittent fasting video for you guys soon. And this will definitely be featured in there because when I received this book, I was just like, oh, oh my God, okay. This is my little key right here. This is the little key piece that I've been needing. All right, guys, thank you so much for rocking with me. Thank you for staying to the end. Make sure you check out P.O.B.O. And until next time, bye.